Happy Tuesday, YouTube. Sue Ortiz here. It is June 21st, first full day of summer 2016. Just getting some footage of the baby turkey vultures. These are the little guys. I wish that I got my camera out in time. I had a whole flock over here. They hole up right next door. There goes one. They like to sleep in this tree over here. I wanted to document a day of no chemtrails. Ever since the wee hours in the morning. Look at that. Not one chemtrail. Now Saturday, I couldn't even be outside. It was so bad, you couldn't breathe. Father's Day, they laid off. Yesterday, we had a few here and there, but today, not one. And I've been up since sun up, and the sun is now setting. First full day of summer, but yeah, that's, that's where the turkey vultures live. I'll give you a quick garden update. There's some cantaloupes. I need to weed desperately over here. Never did get the paper down. Never did get any pumpkins in. Oh, I missed that one going in for a landing. They favor these pine trees. My phone camera won't focus on it. But yeah, they had a nice little flock of babies. These are all the babies. Trying to get them in camera, it's hard. Turkey vultures. They have a four to six foot wingspan when they're adults, so that's why I'm saying these are little guys. That guy's maybe two and a half, three foot wingspan. Little baby. Turkey vultures. Alright, so yeah, no pumpkins, sad to report, no watermelons. There goes another one. They're awesome birds. Alright. The cucumbers are not doing so hot. They keep getting ground attacks by squirrels. You can see what they're doing in the paper here. Like it's not even there. Squirrels, skunks. This is probably my best one. Maybe it'll grow up its little trellis here, but pretty much this is what's going on. I've replanted this guy I don't know how many times. Poor guy. We'll try again. They really like this one for whatever reason. And I, I fill in the dirt, and then I come out in the morning and it's all dug up again. So I don't know about cucumbers this year. I <laughs> tried to grow a maple tree in there, it didn't work. The weeds grow no problem around here, it's amazing. This is an errant sunflower. Like I said, I had some help from the squirrels. They had broken here last year, and so I didn't fix the hole right away, and they managed to plant a few sunflower seeds from the bird feeder. So. Strawberries, I've probably gotten about 20 already. 20 strawberries. These two plants are different from these plants. And these ones are way more expensive, too. Because I started out with just these two. Then I went back the next day and they had these ones for, it was like six of them for the price of what this one was. So that's why I wound up with 18 more. But yeah, I've gotten at least 20 strawberries already. And they're good. Here's the peas. And the beans, what, what beans would come up? 
Got a few few empty spots here. Again, weeds. But I noticed whatever was eating my pepper liked the weeds better and the sunflowers better, so I kind of left them there. But I should thin them out. Here's two more sunflowers. Squirrels planted. I have a banana pepper. I got some more little baby banana peppers starting. Tomatoes galore. These are the Manzano tomatoes. They're good for salsa. And I got a jalapeno. Two of them, but I'd say this one and that banana pepper are ready to be picked. So, there's your garden update, your chemtrail update. No chemtrails today for whatever reason. First full day of summer. And the turkey vultures came home to go to sleep. <laughs> this is when they come home, when the sun gets right about there. All right, everybody have an absolutely fantastic summer 2016.